hello my people welcome once again and this is if i'm with the portals media so i have a quick video which i want to share with us uh, coming from joel ogebe you know the last time i shared a video where they made a comment concerning the conflict between hebert damina and dr paul nature i discovered a lot of persons you know we are very pleased with the kind of comment coming from joel ogebe considering his precedent you know he has been known for a lot of brutal attack on some of you practices on the social media but recently we have been seeing him making statement that suggests as though maybe he's having a retrace or maybe he's changing his way i don't understand but i, I want you to listen to this video right and um, where he made a comment concerning redemption city he has some interesting comments which he made i began to ask myself question is it that joel Ogebe is truly repenting or maybe there is something we are not seeing. But let me know what your thought is uh, on the comment section. So let's get straight to Dre's video. I was in redemption camp yesterday. When I saw, when I saw what God is doing with Papa Adebuye, I went to one corner. I said, God, just in case I've said anything <laughs> that I'm not aware of. It's not easy to have so much authority here to stay quiet. They see some Facebook warriors. Is it about car and land? It's not about car and land, but you don't have it. Even the spirit that it is about, you still don't have that one. That's because they think when you celebrate that kind of thing, what you are celebrating is the material things. It's a reflection of their own heart. Because to the pure, all things are pure. What I saw there was the future. When I was there, I saw the future. A whole civilization that is ruled by Bible. The same way you can go to Muslim states in Nigeria here. However, even though they are in Nigeria, they are still ruled by Sharia. When they drove me into the redemption camp, I was now asking them, where, where does the camp start? They said, I'm inside the camp already. I said, no, but it's house and shop because I've never been there in my life. They said, no, man, no, God, you're inside the camp. I said, I don't understand. I'm seeing banks. They said, yes, this is the whole church. I now knew that I was a Sunday school teacher. <laughs> Okay? There is no type of promotion that can give that thing. No man can receive what God has not given him. <laughs> if you like, buy all the whole billboards in the world. A man cannot have what, it, what was not given to him. That's what Christianity should be. Before you say the father has failed, <laughs> may God help you. <laughs> may, may God help you. That your mouth may not bend quickly. May God help you. Ah, you are speaking over me. I'm not saying this to glorify man. But brother, if a man has managed to walk with God and there is no girl saying he raped me, there is something they know that we need to know. I don't know what I would have been if I was the one that have a quarter of that thing, sir. You are singing over. Now, I understand people might have different opinion as regarding this, okay? People might even want to criticize it. People might even want to ask questions. Is it really all about, you know, building and those structures we get to see? And truth be told, one thing that even comes to mind is when you tend to compare you know, what um, the likes of structured organization or structured religion organization such as um, Church of England or the Roman Catholic Church, what they have achieved, how they've been able to build a strong empire across the globe. So if we are to measure with that, can we actually say it's all about, you know, the structural edifice and the structural attainment? Okay, now, I get, I get very well the sentiment about that. You know and this does not mean to say like i am coming directly against um redemption camp uh that they are here they were far from it you know what people don't even understand is that uh 
growing up right growing up in faith i had my foundation coming up from an orthodox background i also had my foundation also rooted in redeem okay now this is not like me trying to come directly against it there was a time even in one of my video i made mention regardless of what you want to consider them to be regardless of your reasoning regardless of your opinion on how you might say okay they faulted in one doctrine or the other one thing you can not take away from them is that for a man to have been able to achieve that kind of feat is because they know or they have some kind of wisdom and they have some level of discipline and whether you like it or not those are the things those are the good aspects that people are encouraged to learn from right so um this will definitely bring misreaction as always on the platform and you are much more welcome to share your opinion i do want to hear them all i'm reading your comments and please make sure to drop them like share and subscribe